Hi, I'm Jerry Pinckney. I'm um, the illustrator of The Three Little Kittens, which I'm in the process of uh, finishing up today in my studio in Croton on the Hudson, New York. I grew up on uh, fairy tales and folk tales, and I've always had an interest in the classics, starting uh, with the Uncle Remus tales and John Henry, uh, and then the sort of classic European tales like the uh, Little Red Hen, uh, the Nightingale, and now the Three Little Kittens. These classics, um, whether be it folk tale all, or fairy tales, all nourished me uh, as a child growing up in Philadelphia. When I revisit um, the playtime with my children, my grandchildren, and my great-grandchild, um, what I remember is the three little kittens always being a part of it. I think I was attracted first because of the fact that it had uh, was a great rhyme. Um, it's a, uh, it's a nonsense rhyme, by the way, which really opened it up for me because once I connected with the fact that it was a nonsense rhyme, and then I could understand and play with the fact that the three little kitten loses their mittens, uh, they find them, um, and then they soil them by eating pie. So um, when I thought about it again as a nonsense, you can see it just opened up my imagination to a freer play. What I like about uh, illustrating the classics um, is the challenge. Uh, very oftentimes I'll choose a story that may be sparse in text and then go through the process of just unpeeling that story and uh, seeing what's underneath. I then begin to start expanding on it and you get a much richer and deeper story. As far back as I can remember in my married life, we've always had, um, had cats and certainly we started with them as kittens. And um, so what, I, what I've done in, in this case is to revisit those times and those moments and, um, and the observations, by the way, which I think is important because I was observing these kittens and, um, and taking note. So that those revisits um, uh, actually become reference for me, almost like I pull out a file and inside it a file of all those, um, all those memories. And um, at the same time, I knew that it, I couldn't just rely on that, so certainly I used other reference books, uh, photographs of, of, of kittens. And then at one point I realized that um, uh, wouldn't it be a great idea if we had sort of stuffed kittens? So um, we managed to find two stuffed kittens and I've actually, I can actually hold them in my hand and turn them, manipulate them away that I get a better understanding of the anatomy of the, of the kitten. What I hope to do with the uh, three little kittens is to rekindle the sort of interest um, from grandparents, um, from mothers and from fathers, and for those children that are hearing this classic rhyme for the first time.